Hi friends. Just sitting in my car opening up my mail really quick while I let the car warm up here. Let's see if I can put the brake on. And I just got thinking about some of the interactions that I've had with you guys. I don't know, it gave me an idea of a, a video to do. Maybe I'll do it today. What is this from? <gasps> Sweet! Yay! I, mean, I can't show you a whole ton of information, but that's kind of fun. Okay, see who that's from? That's Hawaiian Airlines. Guess whose credit just got bumped up? And now that it really wasn't um, bumped up a ton, <laughs> but that will make it possible for us to earn points faster on our Hawaiian Airlines credit cards. So that's fantastic. Hopefully there's another one in here for my cards. That one was Jason's card. I pay them both at the same time. What that envelope look like? Maybe there's another one. Ooh. No, that's, that's my cable bill. Oh well, whatever. It's fine. As long as one of them increases. So Jason was gonna call about that tomorrow. Now we don't have to, but I am curious about the other account, but it's okay. So I, I thought today I would do a small, maybe not today. I'm just gonna do a daily video today, but let me know. Actually, I'm gonna do it because I think it's a fun idea and it's, I think, useful. I think I'm going to teach you guys in a video how to make your own videos. I'm not trying to turn you guys into YouTubers, but one of you has mentioned that they that you have a whole bunch of videos and pictures from past trips and you're going on trips coming up and you want to document your trips, both past and future. And you have all these videos, GoPro, photos, videos, and you don't know what to do with it. I am going to give you guys a crash course in creating your own memories. And the reason why I wanna do that is because you don't have to be a YouTuber to figure this stuff out or to have a reason to do it. The reason why I wanna do it is because you should be able to like capture your vacations or, or anything. Maybe it's your grandkids, maybe it's your kids. You should be able to learn how to do this so that you can capture those memories. It's one thing to have all our videos and photos on our, on our phone. Speaking of which, do I have my phone with me? <laughs> it's one thing to have them here, but we don't like print them out anymore, we don't put them in albums, we don't do anything with it. So if you, you know, and it's fun to like glance back and look at them. Oh, my neighbor's coming. Hang on, we'll, we'll come back to this. All right, I literally have to leave and go to this appointment that I, I just have a scan, the ones I volunteer for. But if you were able to take your photos and your videos and make an actual video of a vacation or your grandkids, you would have that you would have like a consecutive memory to be able to look back on. And I wanna teach you guys how to do that. Cause I know that it's intimidating. Believe me, I know it's intimidating. But if I can teach you um, not only from the past how to take what you got and make it work, because there's a good chance that you've taken a lot of videos vertically. There's a good chance you have a lot of photos taken vertically because that's just our, our normal, you know, we take photos like this versus videos and photos like this. But when you're editing and making it into an actual video, your things need to go like that. So it's just an idea I have. If I have time today, I'm going to do that video for you guys because it just kind of sparked something in me and I'm behind enough in videos that you'll actually see that video fast. Um, and so I think I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. But I gotta go to this appointment and then we'll carry on for the day. But now I'm really excited because I wanna show you it's easier than you think. And then going forward, you're gonna know how to take videos going forward in order to capture the memory. And you don't need to talk in front of the camera like I am. Like you don't need to do vlog style because it is awkward to like learn how to do and be comfortable with it, especially in public. Um, but I can teach you how to do it where you don't have to do that. You can just capture the memory of it and put it to music or whatnot. And I'm, I'm very excited if you can't tell, but I gotta go, I gotta go. All right, I'm all done. But one thing that the techs have been asking me the last three visits that I've done here at the ultrasound scan place that I volunteer for is that they've asked me if I have a gallbladder while they have an ultrasound wand on my stomach. And I'm like, can't you see? 
that I don't have a gallbladder? <laughs> like, why are you the third person now that's asked me if I have a gallbladder? And she's like, well, I just want to make sure because I see staples in there. And she's like, I think that's staples from your gallbladder. And I'm like, or getting taken out. And I was like, oh, I didn't know there were staples in there, but yeah, gallbladder came out. <laughs> Hopefully you don't see one in there. And she's like, no, 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 I don't see one. That's why I'm making sure that that's why there's staples in there. So, and I think I might actually make an appointment to get my nails done here. I want them nice for my birthday. So let's see if we can get an appointment. And yes, it's sunny enough for sunglasses, which is crazy. Hello? Do you have any appointments this morning for a dip nail uh, redo? Yes, please, yeah, please. 1130? Yeah, I can do 1130. Okay, what's your name? Dana, D-A-Y-N-A. -A. Okay, put the, uh, the dip, right? Yeah, I have dip on now. I just need it redone. Okay. All right, thank you. Okay, thank you. Uh-huh. Bye. Sweet. So, I already wanted to go to Costco. Yes, I'm, I know. We go to Costco all the time. I'm gonna, I'm not buying regular groceries unless I find, shoot, I had it thought in my head late last night. Hang on, I gotta put you down to get my seatbelt on. Uh, what was it? It was one grocery item. So I didn't have to go to the store. But I'm gonna look through like clearance stuff, like clearance clothes and things like that. See if there's anything we can stock up on. Someone was showing that there's like coats and stuff around clearance for like seven dollars but i don't need any coats we got unfortunately we paid full price for a new coat and three pairs of snow pants so we don't need any of those anymore we should be set on snow pants honestly like we should be set set on those for the rest of the girls like days wearing snow pants because now i've got all of those a, not adult, but like I was listening to Hawaiian music <laughs> while I was in there. Anyway, I digress. So I have an hour. That sun. So wonderful. So foreign. Um, I'm going to run over to Costco just for the fun of it and just peruse. And I know there's something else. I'm going to kick myself. Do you guys do that? Like, I didn't write it down anywhere. It had it in my head late last night i woke up from, from kind of like a nightmare bad dream i guess it was more of a bad dream i was trying to like shift my brain and think about something else and uh now i can't remember what it was shoot but let's go over to costco i don't think i need gas but i definitely want to just go i have an hour to kill now there's no point in going home all right, I've already come in here finding things. This is only $5, it's for Jason, but I need a cart. I've already found three more things I need, but I need a cart. All right, now we're back in action here. And of course, as soon as I get the cart, I don't find anything for me. <laughs> this is for Jason. There is a lot of coats and stuff on clearance, but I don't need any coats. But I did find this. I remember the other thing, which is probably why I wanted this thing. I think they have a high correlation. <laughs> All right, I went short and nubby instead of taking them off. I don't know, I'm trying to get this. I asked them about it and they, they didn't really know. They put some oil on it. I'm gonna try and find an oil to use at home. But we went short and nubby this time. But I asked her about doing like this pale pink, like clear color with like a, an ombre white tip. So I think I'm gonna try that. Um, these need to grow out now, but um, when I have them a little bit longer, I'll do that. The sunshine is just like so strange. Um, anyway, it's, it's super nice. It's chilly still, but it feels good. I'm gonna kind of sit here in the car for a second. Ugh, my hips <laughs> are a little bit sore today. I uh, edited yesterday without um, walking on my treadmill and I kind of felt guilty about doing that. Um, and so when I went to take Ashley to her um, cheer, class I went ahead and walked at the community center and I just I walked and I walked and I walked the entire hour and a half that she was in class and I got done and I was at 13,000 steps so I did pretty good that was I walked five miles at the community center but I had walked a mile like walked that was just like my normal like whatever around the house and I think I ran to the store 
um, one time. So I did like six, six and a half miles yesterday and my hips are feeling it today. <laughs> and so I, I knew I had all of these things that I wanted to do today, so I, I knew I wasn't gonna get on the treadmill, but also I'm doing a Zumba class tonight. Some girlfriends of mine from church are just doing like a little um, Zumba class just to get together and uh, I have never done Zumba before. And uh, so we're gonna go try it. I'm gonna just go and have fun with it. I'm gonna do it, you know, pretty light just because my, my legs are, not my legs, but it's really my hips <laughs> um, are pretty sore, but it'll feel good to kind of stretch them out and, and that kind of thing. If I don't really feel like it feels good or I, I don't like it or whatever, I might just leave um, and either go back over to the community center and walk around that or just come home and relax for the night just because we're not even going to do the Zumba class until like 7 o'clock. So, um, anyway, I don't have more, any more plans. <laughs> I probably should go home and edit. And I'll go film that. Maybe I have time. Maybe I'll go home and film that video showing you guys kind of the basics on how to edit a video to make your little holiday vacations. I know you a lot of you have vacations coming up and you're planning them. And I just wanna give you some basic tips to be able to like, you can do this. I know you can do this. And I'm excited to kind of share it with you guys. And I challenge so many of you to try this. If you have an iPhone and you have, you have all the abilities to do this. Well, not even if you have an iPhone, but if you have a Mac, I, I only do it on iMovie. I only know how to do it in, in iMovie. So. Those are the two requirements. <laughs> We're an Apple family over here. All right, I have been perusing good deals for Hawaii. That's literally what I've been doing. And I've also been editing today's current video because I'm that caught up. And now I need to find, I'm gonna put you right here because part of what I need is a tripod. I only have a little itty bitty one out and I need to film that video that I was telling you about showing you guys how to make videos. This is really good lighting right here. Let's see what I can find. That is my father-in-law's tripod he gave me. That's like overkill and it doesn't have the right attachment put my camera on you guys here let me show you this is like all my old camera equipment this is like lights that I can set up if I need good lighting for a video I don't really do that it's what I use mainly when I did like crafting videos all right I don't think there's a tripod in there I think it's in here all right I found me a tripod can't show it to you because you're on one Let's see if this works here. I'm trying to, you're getting a little behind the scenes. I'm gonna try and sit there at the desk, but I need the light from behind. So let's see here. And yes, I tried these. Yes, they're good. Yes, I'm gonna put them back in the pantry. I only had a few, so did not nibble. I've been trying to nibble on this water, so. Alrighty prop you up here. So if I can get this kind of propped up using light, then, also I changed my sweater so it looks like it's a different day. <laughs> All right, so if I show you the computer like that in the video, do you know what I mean? So I'm gonna hurry and film this video before the chaos of the night ensues, see how much I can get done. But maybe I need to clean this off. That looks kind of nasty. Does it look nasty when the screen is on? No, you can't tell. No, no point in going through the effort of cleaning it off if you can't tell. All right, I'm gonna hurry and film this video. I'll be right back. Guys, I'm sweating like a pig. Oh my gosh, you don't understand how much it takes to make those videos. It's taken me, let me see what time is it? Two hours. Taking me two hours to make that video. I'm dying of heat, but I kept my cute sweater on. I'm gonna put my other little jacket on 
take Ashley to go get some shoes. Um, I'm glad I filmed that video. I hope you guys like it, and I hope that you, you guys haven't seen it yet. You'll see it tomorrow, but I hope you enjoy it, and I hope that it gives you, like, motivation to uh, film your own videos. Capture your vacations. Capture special moments. Maybe it's just like your daughter's birthday, your granddaughter's birthday, or start small. But I promise you, you're not gonna regret filming yourself or your family or your vacations. Um, you're not gonna regret it. But I gotta take Ashley now. She needs new shoes in general. I was trying to hold out for a little bit longer, but she has to have plain white ones for cheer. And I'm not buying one pair of shoes for one day. Just not going to do it. So I am, I think everyone's here. I'll lock that door back up. Um, Kaylee, I'm taking her to get shoes. Ashley, let's go. Kaylee and Jacob already asleep. Come on, Ash. Um, so I'm just going to get her a new pair, and she's going to have to have them be all white. We might see if they have like a another pair of laces that can kind of add color. But um, yeah, I'm just not gonna get her a brand new pair of shoes just for one event and then never wear them again. I also have a pair of her boots that I got her for Christmas. Either they don't fit or she doesn't like them, they're not comfortable. So I might return those to Marshalls. Right, you don't like those shoes? They, they fit funny, right? Yeah, they are weird. Okay, do you have good socks on? Yes. We actually should go over to Marshalls and get you new socks. Okay, um, so we didn't have much luck. Well, we did have luck finding Ashley a pair of shoes at um, Dick's. I just couldn't film in there because they had their music turned up really loud and there wasn't anyone in there to like cut the sound down. <laughs> anyway, um, we did find a pair of shoes. They're just high tops and they're, they're cute and they'll work and I don't think they're, they're not so high that the coach will not approve them for um, cheer, but they were like 70, 80 bucks. And I'm like, I'm not willing to spend $80 on a nine year old's pair of shoes. <laughs> just, I'm just not. So I'm gonna do a little investigative work myself to try and find a pair that is cheaper. And if not, Kaylee can give me her, well, she has to go with us to purchase the shoes to give her employee discount. So, and that will make it affordable, hopefully. So, just have to find a time when she can go with me. And um, I am headed to uh, Zumba. Is that what it's called? I'm gonna really embarrass myself if that's not what it's called. Anyway, my friends are all meeting and I'm picking up a friend and going with me. It's really red because the person's lights ahead of me. Um, well, I don't know if I might be embarrassing myself a ton by going to do this, but that's okay. I, that's fine. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be too exhausted to end it after this, so just in case, I hope you guys are having a good week, getting ready for, well, I'm getting ready for the weekend. <laughs> um, I have a call coming in. Take care, you guys. Easy, easy on our tiptoes.